I'm back. I'm back. Nullius, nullius, nullius. We've explored so much. And let's just get on back to base now that we've got this nice iron. It would be hilarious if we discovered some new stuff on the way on the way back to base, eh? It'd be just hilarious. Let's see if I can do this without hitting any rocks. And let's see. I spent uh, the morning making some train blueprints. So I'll leave that as an unlisted video because I did record myself, but I think it ended up just being like a complete mess. I'm so bad at designing rails. <laughs> so uh, you guys don't have to watch it unless you're curious. Um, and yeah, it might be interesting to see how I arrived at some of the uh, bad design decisions that I arrived at. <laughs> Oh no, we're on volcanoes. The rocks. The rocks. Uh, Alien Biomes mod um, adds these little sections of rocky, volcanic. Ah! And it also makes me slow, doesn't it? It's really obvious. Uh, there's a setting, you can turn it off. You can turn off the slow speed on volcanic thing, but I have not turned it off. It is on, um, and yeah, it it, it makes it, it makes it hard. All right, here's our nice base. Everything's working well. I don't know why I'm just driving willy nilly through here. Can I pick things up? I cannot pick my car up. Ooh, we have water canisters, and once we, what was it? Once we, hmm. Surely we've consumed two hydrogen canisters in our car. I'm not really sure why that green bar is. Oh, it's halfway because we've done one of these things, but not the other. I was expecting it to be two-thirds of the way fold. Okay, let's consume one water canister with a uh, barreling pump. I learned this while I was designing my um, rail network because it uh, includes... Um, uh, what does it include? It includes the uh, fueling. Cool, and then get rid of that, and look at that. Fueling demonstration completed. We'll get rid of that stuff, huh? All right, now I can pick up my car, right? No, I can't, because I have empty canisters now to get rid of. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> uh, fair enough. All right, now I don't have empty canisters to get rid of. I can pick up my car with its hydrogen canisters intact, which we should <laughs> go put down here. All right, I won't forget my fuels down there for no no reason. And, well, let's see. I do want to automate cargo wagons at the very least because cargo wagons are, you. well, I have to automate it because it's made of lubricant. Um, and, yeah, they're used in locomotives. So we're going to have, for each train, we're going to have eight cargo wagons plus two locomotives is my plan. And that's what I've designed my train network for. So this won't be too bad, actually. Steel, small chest is steel and rubber, and then the locomotives is a bunch of steel. And luckily, I have my steel going through here. Now, where is the rubber and the graphite? Uh, rubber and glass. Uh, okay, I don't need, yeah, now's the time. Now's the time. Oh, I have so much, I have so much stuff. Oh, brother. <clears throat> Get rid of it. Get rid of it. Uh, that's steel, isn't it? Okay. Yeah, I don't really need the iron intermediates anymore. Okay, so instead of doing... Oh, wait. There was stuff I needed, wasn't there? Because I need insulated wire here. Yeah, it was that very first one that I got rid of. Okay. Is that all going the right way? No. I needed the aluminum going down and the rubber and glass going up. Although I might change that rubber and glass thing here. All right. Uh, oh, man. That's what should have happened. 
So that underground is going to take the insulated wire only. And it'll appear uh, right here. Okay, good. So we didn't mess anything up there. Now, locomotives. I actually wonder if I can cram in chests somewhere. I think I have chests on a belt, don't I? Because I needed chests for... Uh, here we go. Surely I had chests in a in a box, though. Do I not? Chest, 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 chest. Well, I can't find it, so I must have gotten rid of it. Um, chest and pipe, are those used together at all? Oh, no. It's just used for um, small chests. All right. Rubber and steel. Hmm. 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 And let's see. What are these? Uh, just rods and sheets. So if I put it over here, do, 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 steel and rubber. Yeah, I'll be able to get chests over here. What is What are the small chests using? Right, cargo wagons, large chests, small assembler twos, better chests, and logistics chests. Okay, okay. Not not quite sure if if this is what I want to do. <laughs> I'm not quite too sure. All right. I wonder actually if I can. Let's see. If I do. Something like that. And then the rubber situation. <clears throat> um. Hmm. Hmm. Huh, 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 huh. Adabada, burr, 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 burr. Mm, no, that's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. I'm trying to get rubber over here, and it's proving obnoxious wait are those ingots wait what is that oh yeah that was an interesting decision to put the ingots going up that way instead of closer to my bauxite because on my iron I just have the belt going straight up to my iron processing here uh, anyways anyways Oh, stuff's a mess. All right. Not sure if I want glass over here, but oh well. <laughs> All right. And then we just needed... Let's see. Let's see. Shift L and then grab it from there. So I can put it in a chest. Excellent. And then shift L and I can put it in another chest there. And we've got small chest twos automated if I did it right. <clears throat> yep, we're just waiting on those chests. That'll work. And then we'll dump it here. All right. And those should probably go in a belt because they're used in a bunch of random stuff um, doo -doo -doo, that I want over here. Now, what else uh, do I want? Uh, what else do I need for cargo wagons? Uh, let's see. Not usage. I want to know how to make it. I need graphite. And the steel. Stuff. Okay. So I guess I'll just do... I guess I'll just do this number. <laughs> yeah. 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 That's going to be a lot of chests. <laughs> a lot of resources. <laughs> okay, and then the steel stuff, huh? Which... Could I get the chest down here? Wait, 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 wait. No, the cargo wagon doesn't need rubber. It needs graphite. And the graphite is... It's lost. I can pull it here, or I can come down... No, I can't come down. This is the only place where graphite is so far, so let's... Let's get it through here. We have one option, and that is to run 
the plastic and graphite belts uh, this way. Okay, so maybe I can cram locomotives here. Do I or the cargo wagons here? I need a medium assembler for it. We need the lubricant. Fun, fun, fun. So I'll take it from up here. Perfect. And then let's see. Let's see. That'll get all the steel we need. Yes. Six second crafting time. So it should be fine. And then... If I were to instead bump it here, power pull two in the way, huh? We can grab the graphite there. Okay, and I didn't want this junk cluttering up my inventory, no siree. Well, maybe I do want the steel plates cluttering up my inventory. All right, graphite I don't need. Okay, let's cut the lubricant like so, and then figure out how to get the chest down here, which it's super easy. All we have to do is, <laughs> let's see, which one was that? Oh wait, uh, it's coming here. Hmm. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. All right, good. Reach and then... Oh wait, no, that's not what I wanted. Yeah, I did need it. I did need it over here. So we're gonna reach there. That's gonna extend to get the plates and maybe the rods. Yeah, plates and rods. And then we'll reach the side of this where the chests are coming. Wow, that's just a thing of beauty. All right, we got the chest going to our cargo wagons. And that means we do not want those things. Okay, now, oops. All those chests were in there, huh? Okay, cool. Replace power and put alt mode back on and we're getting rails and we're getting cargo wagons once we Get lubricant. Okay Lubricant should be pretty easy, huh? Uh, where's the horizontal? Let's take it like here I guess Or up a little further past the aluminum Hmm. Hmm. I'd like to not get in the way of the aluminum. I think I will just leave the aluminum there, even though it's kind of weird taking the ingots. But um, maybe if I cut it here on top of those belts. Although maybe I like keeping the belts separate from. What am I trying to say? Keep the belts separate from the pipes because I've noticed that uh, things get sticky if I if I do that. If I put the pipes next to the belts, uh, like I did down here, then it's just, it becomes more of a mess. Hmm. So this is fine. It's fine. Super speedy. Oh, there's my lubricant. All right, and we can take Get rid of all this stuff, huh? There's a bunch of stuff in here, though, eh? Hey. hey. Okay. All right. All right. Hold on. Hold on. And just like that, our inventory is totally full, but we were able to pick all this stuff up. <laughs> like magic. And lubricant is draining. I'm a little surprised, actually, we didn't have more lubricant in here. Uh, fluid ingredient shortage of methanol. <clears throat> methanol ingredient shortage because we only have one thing making it obviously 
We have plenty of hydrogen, kind of. Uh, low power. Should we get more wind or just trust that the wind will come back? Yeah, if you look, we've had a long stretch with lots of wind, but then lately, no wind. Uh, so I think we'll be probably okay. That's the nice thing about the surge uh, electrolyzers is that when you have low power, it's okay because they're the ones that take the brunt of it and everything else continues working. And since you have big buffers of those gases that you need, uh, you don't need the surge electrolyzers to run 24-7. Okay, well, what are we missing here? We got the lube to the cargo wagons, so we've got plenty of cargo wagons. Okay, fun, fun, fun. And I can put it on a belt so that we can automate stuff, but I can also put it in a chest. And these stack to 10, maybe? Not very much. Maybe just, maybe, maybe even just five. So if they stack to five. I think I'm okay with a huge chest full because when I want trains, I'm going to want three at once, you know? I'm going to want 24 cargo wagons at once plus the uh, locomotives. And then the locomotives, we need generators and steel gears. And the generators are... Du -du 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 small cargo pods, which are iron wires. Should I make... Should I automate all this stuff? Is this going to turn into a... What am I doing here? Is this going to turn into a mall episode? Generators, logistics bots. Yeah, we're gonna need to, we're gonna need to automate this, aren't we? What is large cargo pods? Better logistics bots. All right, small chest and iron wire. Let's just let's just make it happen, huh? Yeah. Oh yeah. Easy. Wait. Okay, yeah, we just had to wait for that thing. Okay, and then why did I want these? So that we can make generators and other stuff when we get there. Okay. Which means we'll want a chest. Yes, indeed. Combustion chamber. I'm not automating those, right? I'm just automating these turbines. Okay. And let's see. I need those for the locomotives. So I can just make a few. Yeah. Oh, they stacked a five. Yeah. So when, yeah, when we want trains, I'm going to want half a chest of cargo wagons pretty much. All right. And then I can't make this because steel intermediates. Um... Well, let's just... Oh my gosh. Uh, aluminum. Oh, I'll be right back. Just like magic, my aluminum's gone. I still have random junk in here. Oh well. <laughs> Alright, steel gears, was it? It was indeed. It was indeed. Can I do it in a small assembler? I can. I can. Uh, let's see. Do I need steel gears for like a crap ton of stuff? Let's find out. Yes. 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 Which means... Ooh, is it time for motors? Should I just go ahead and put motors in here? We need the lubricant. We need the rubber, which we have here. Belts. Oh wait, that's not what I wanted. I wanted to check motor twos. Oh, okay, okay, here we go. So steel stuff and insulated wire, okay. Uh, including the gears. So, perfect, perfect. Let's do that. Uh, and by do that, I mean we will make several gear things. Did I do that right? Yeah. Put it on a belt running this way and then do several uh, uh, medium assemblers, huh? Uh, because I, I, I assume it's medium assemblers because I need um, a fluid input of 
of um, lubricant. Sorry. Oh, where? Inter it's got to be intermediates. There it is. Okay. Medium assemblers. Yes, I am correct, sir. And yeah, that means we'll want it. Oh, how am I going to do this actually? Because I need the two steel inserters. And then I need the gear inserter. Uh, okay, I think I might have a plan here. No, hmm. it's going to be hard to tile it. I suppose I'll do it like so. And I'm assuming I want a bunch of it. Uh, I'm assuming these are slow to craft. And they're used in a bunch of stuff like belts. Yeah, yeah they're used in just... Just plenty of stuff, huh? Including motor threes, small minor twos, which is coming. Um, okay, and are they slow to craft? As I suspected, very slow to craft. Okay. So let's plan on making them copy it and pasteable. All right, and shift L these all out to hit the belt right here. <clears throat> then we can take them on. Okay, and oh, we also need the insulated wire, which we can, let's see here. Yeah, that's where we want it. Just like so. All right, insulated wire. Gears are gonna be on the opposite side of the belt. And motors are crafting, which we will put on a belt running like so. Actually, I'm changing my mind here. How much, okay, I got plenty of space. Plenty of space. Let's take the insulated wire on its own thing. Well, hmm, hmm, hmm. We need motors and gears for belt twos. I mean, that's reason enough to put them on the same belt, right? Even if nothing else uses motors and gears. Okay. And nothing else does use motors and gears. So why am I checking it? I don't know. <clears throat> All right. Uh, and then these will go on the near side. Very good. And we're missing lubricant, that's why we're not crafting. And then pick up the insulated wire. Perfect. And I did that wrong. So not, not quite perfect, huh? All right, Whew. Insulated wires are going. Lubricant. Ooh, just perfect in schlag. And we've got motors, oh, just like that. Is it time for red belts? <laughs> Which also require lubricant, uh, motors and gears we have, and then we just need rubber and the belts. Which, um, 15, uh, so three a second. Sorry, I was looking at uh, 15 belts every five seconds. And then these give me eight, uh, eight belts every eight seconds. So one every second. Oh, and oh, and they consume 10 every eight seconds. So I think I just need, yeah, I can supply with this. I can supply... <clears throat> like three red belts, practically. Although I need a medium assembler. <laughs> That's complicated. So yeah, I can supply one medium assembler making red belts. And then 
of course, I'm also using these belts for the undergrounds and splitters, and I'm using them for the um, small assembler. So that probably means we'll run out of yellow belts instead of the red belts, but uh, that's okay. I can put it down here, right? Ooh, maybe, no, I need to take the belt to the left to get the gears there. I was gonna say maybe I take the belt to the east and then I can expand it this way, but no, that doesn't make any sense. I'm just, I'm talking nonsense. All right, ooh, ooh. Check that out, that's cool. All right, rubber. Can I put the rubber with the insulated wire? Does that make sense? Or should I leave it with the glass? I'm not sure. Well, in any case, uh, that's easy enough. And th that's easy enough. Maybe I should put the rubber with the belts? That could be cool. Let's do the rubber with the belts here. So to get rubber off of this belt, I let's take the whole thing. Take all the glass this way too. And then I'll want, I'll wanna push it off like so. <laughs> Actually, oh, I don't know what I'm doing. This is ridiculous. So ridiculous. All right. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> okay. And that's gonna be everything, right? You just need to put it in a chest. Cool. Low power, all right. The wind is not enough. Let's bump up the power. <laughs> Can I make locomotives yet? Now I need motor ones? Motor ones? And I can make locomotives. Let's see. To make generators, I need more of these cargo pods. I just kind of want to make... Uh, what am I doing here? Yeah, good. I don't have any of those things automated, so that's good. Let's just make a bunch of locomotives right now, and that way I don't, you know, ever need to craft them. Steel gears. All right, this should be enough locomotives for quite some time, huh? Now, please tell me what about this is stupid, please. Please, please, sir. Just steel gears, huh? I guess I can handcraft steel gears. The low power still, huh? The wind is so unreliable. For the last 10 minutes, or the last five minutes, four minutes, okay, why am I exaggerating? For the last three and a half minutes, <laughs> we have not had enough power. Hmm. The backup turbine, oh, that's what we need. We need the backup turbines so that when we have extra hydrogen, we have lots of steam because we ran out of that really quickly. All right, there's our wind. Let's go surgy mix surge. Give me that hydro that sweet sweet hydrogen. Man, I get that so fast. <laughs> All right. I'm just, sorry, I'm just curious, when does it go here? 25% pressure? Oh, interesting. I was, yeah, kind of wrong about supplying. Oh, that's not helpful. That's what's, that was, that was horrible. Oh, none of that is helpful. All right, I'm gonna run down there real quick. Uh, all that, oh, I did not mean to pause it. All that was throttling my, um, my, <clears throat> what was it throttling? My hydrogen. All right, so that should be better, right? 
all this stuff can flow now, sort of. Now let's see, why don't I have a pump? Why don't why aren't I pumping this tank up? It's because Wait. What am, where am I taking this hydrogen? This isn't this is an output. That hydrogen is an output of the okay. Because I'm taking in the hydrogen chloride and then pumping out the uh, hydrogen. Okay. So yeah, I can totally pump the hydrogen in here. And that'll help immensely, right? If I had a pump. Wow, I have a lot of locomotives and cargo wagons. Awesome. <laughs> Okay, all right. The output's still full, but I think we're gonna see. Yes. Oh yes, baby. Okay, now we got the hydrogen. Now we are supplying our backup to make steam for when we have low power. All right. Brief intermission there. Let's go dump our locomotives, or we, we'll we make more locomotives with the gears that we've gotten with all of our power. And we have red belts, and I believe there's a checkpoint to place two underground, underground belt twos and inserter twos. Wow, okay, what do we need for inserter twos? Aluminum rods, oh, but pretty easy other than that. Um, Steel gears, insert ones, <laughs> aluminum rods. Okay, maybe not, maybe not easy, easy, but maybe easy. All right, and uh, what was I gonna do here? Oh, craft all the, yeah, 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 craft all the locomotives that I could. So we don't have the generators because we don't have the combustion chambers because we don't have the small furnaces. <laughs> Ooh, it's always something. And this is why you don't handcraft stuff like this. But I swear, I'm not going to use much more of this, Captain. Yeah, oh, that's so many locomotives. This is, this is just wonderful. It's just so wonderful. More motors. And then we will, we will be done. I'm going to be done. What do you guys think? I'll be done. All right. Those can go back. Locomotives we can put in there. We're crafting a bunch more, but that's fine. All right, insulated wires. What do I want to do with that? In the motors. Because I don't want insulated wires, no siree. And let's do inserter twos now. Uh, motor ones and gears. So motor ones are here. Gears are here. So let's cut this down. Sure. All right, and then inserter ones are on this belt here, unfortunately. We're gonna have to do some higgledy piggledy. All right, I only want the belts going up here so we can filter it or we can, uh, how do I do this? Something like that. Okay, so now I still have belts here. That that way, if we want belts, we can get belts. I think there's an, probably a better way to do that with filter inserter. I'm trying to think. If I had split it like that and then filtered... Yeah, oh yeah. I could have done... Uh, the belt being filtered here, just like that. And that's that's not quite as insane, you know. <laughs> yeah, and when the inserters back up, it doesn't back up. Okay, we're good. All right, and we'll take the inserters this way. Well, now, now, oh, see, now my belts are on both sides of this little river of <laughs> stuff <laughs> that's so silly all right all right let's see here grab the inserters 
Grab the motors, grab the steel gears, and the last step, the aluminum rods, which just uh, reposition things here. And scooch this around here. And up and over. Wait. Like so. And sure. <laughs> All right. And now we have filter things and I'll put it in a chest over here and we all when we want a lot of them we're gonna want a lot of them <clears throat> oh wait I call them filter inserters because they're purple right they're purple in the vanilla game yeah oh now control oh that was not right all right what do I do here oh I know chip though there we go Cool. When we got inserters, do I also want filter inserters? I mean, it's so easy. We just got to set it up. Can I get away with this? I can get away with this. Shift L to grab the logic circuits. Shift L to grab the inserters, baby. Let's go. Are those actually used in stuff? Let's see. They are used in stuff. Foundry 2s require them. That's so weird. So do regular inserter 3s. Oh, um, maybe you can filter those. Maybe they're... At a certain point, you stop having the option to not have filter inserters. They're used in robot frames. This is madness. <laughs> All right, well... Let's put down some... Red belts. Oh, now where do we want red belts? Oh, I know the um, the iron <coughs> ore belt. Yes, yes, yes. What is happening? Oh, we don't have enough miners. <sighs> All right. Well, let's just start putting this down because if you'll remember when we upgraded our um. Our iron setup. It could not. Oh my gosh, no! Ah! <laughs> That's hilarious. Alright, where is it? Oh my gosh. Come to Papa. Come to Papa. <laughs> you guys can see the belts on the iron ore belt, right? The belts on the belts? Alright, I think we got it all. Jeez Louise. Alright, how did that even happen? Oh, I got iron ore, I guess. All right, well, we want to place... Oh, it was the underground belts that we needed, huh? Well, luckily, that's pretty easy. Oh, we also want to automate the pipes, underground pipes, huh? You can't answer it. <laughs> All right, so let's see here. That's where we wanted it. How many did we need? Why isn't that done? Ten. Hmm. And one more. And then the filter inserters, which let's actually, let's use those, okay? Let's not just um, put them down for the sake of getting the checkpoint. Let's actually do something productive, huh? Uh, that's what we wanted. How many more undergrounds do I have? Probably that was the only one. Huh? Oh, cool. And then we can get a splitter, which we barely have the steel sheets for. Phew. Okay. So that might actually help, sort of. It won't, but it it might. All right. And then what do we need better inserters for? What? I know there was some stuff that I needed good inserters, and I didn't have. Oh, this stuff's full, huh? Mineral dust is full. 
And it's because we don't have the acid. Okay, 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 hold on. I know this is totally not what we were gonna do, but we have more, uh, let's see, we don't have enough chlorine. Oh, it's because I did something stupid over here. Oh, that is so stupid. Hang on. It's not stupid. Is this not working here? This is exactly what I wanted. It's exactly what I wanted. I wanted the plastic belt to stop. Yeah, okay, so now this will back up. And then we will have more chlorine. Uh, that will then be, let's see. Oh, we do have hydrogen chloride. Wait, wait, we have plenty of hydrogen chloride. The output is full. What on earth? Did I disconnect things? What on, oh my gosh. <laughs> This is so silly. How did that even happen? No one knows. No one knows. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, it's because I... Oh my gosh. I went on that whole spiel about like, oh, you want the... um, <laughs> You want the main source providing it through these bad pipes so that it'll flow here. Okay. I'm just being so silly. Is this a good example of where we want? No. Ooh, 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 yeah, here. We don't have enough gravel. Because these inserters aren't good enough. Let's upgrade them. <laughs> I don't actually think that was necessary. <laughs> oh, I didn't have enough, huh? Let's go grab it. And it's the end of the 14th hour, huh? Should I just put those inserters in everything? Maybe I'll stop using the um, bad inserters now. I can unhockey it. Uh, yeah. Wait, what am I doing? That's not what I wanted. That's what I wanted. And we'll put those bad inserters back and we'll hotkey the good inserters like a so. Okay, um, and then I wanted to come back because I have those good inserters now. Wanted to come back. And finish finish that and we need two more inserters where should they go ah here's a good here's a good use for them there we go we don't need two inserters for each one no we don't just one inserter should do the trick boss do i have enough inventory for that junk sure all right guys we got the demonstration going we can get optimization. We can, that's the modules. Um, and these are just little modules that we can put in everything. It's gonna be fantastic. Automation two. Yes, please. Sensors that will let us get, um, I think the sensors actually may be placeable and you can yeah, they're like the, the radar. It's just not quite as good, I think. We can get better mining. Oh, yes, baby, better miners. Oh, thank the maker. Thank the freaking maker. Uh, combustion of organic. Ah, these are better fuels, aren't they? I think. Oh, cool. We can get hydrogen straight out of hydrogen canisters. Oh, that's a lot better. Oh wait, no, no, no. Sorry, sorry. Never mind. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking. I was thinking the um, when you use trains, they uh, use hydrogen canisters and turn them into water canisters, right? And cars, um, but we'll still have to barrel out the water. Okay. Um, we definitely need train stops. <laughs> uh, so let's get trains. I didn't. I didn't actually realize we couldn't put the trains down. I was planning on I was planning on actually using those rails that I had. Should I show you guys what I did? Uh let's see. Oh, not the wind farm. I wanted a blueprint. Let's play Nullius right there. This has let's see. This has the first solar that we did, very nice. It has the wind farm. And then it has some straight sections. Um and then it has a T junction. And then it has a loading station. And then it has this massive thing. Where can I, 
I can't even show you where it goes, but it's it's awesome. It's awesome. I'm going to plop it down over here somewhere and unload all the ore. It's going to be going to be good, but uh mining, I think we got to focus on mining next time, don't we? And yeah, it's the end of the 14th hour, so I'm going to call it here. And I guess I don't need to upload that <laughs> the blueprint. So uh, sometime this weekend, I will upload the long video of me making these rails. Feel free to check it out. Should I unlist it, though? Because I don't really want people to just look at it and be like, oh, this guy's an idiot. Um, I only want people to look at it if they're interested in it. <laughs> so... Yeah, I think I'll unlist it. So I'll link to it in this video. If you guys are, are really curious, come back, check out um, uh, this video so you can find the link to the blueprints. And that's going to do it for this episode where we got cargo wagons up. We got belt twos up. We got logis uh, the um, better inserters up. Uh, what else did we do? I forget. Some really random stuff. Chess. Um, yeah, which we are going to have in a nice box here and we're going through our, we're going through our steel and our iron like crazy. So yeah, look at that next episode. Um, hopefully we'll have better miners. Uh, the medium minor twos are what we're going to want. So I'm going to automate medium minor twos, which is going to be a lot of, fun. we need aluminum carbide for them. That's hilarious. Uh, before I forget. Let's make sure we have... Uh, how do I want to do this? Something like so. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, I have all this junk. I have all the junk, don't I? Uh, I didn't have that junk, though. Okay. And then did I have any of that junk? I did. And did I have any of that junk? I don't. Okay. <clears throat> All right. So we always want the output to go this way. And then... Let's load up a chest of this stuff, shall we? Uh, let's see here. We want those pointing to a belt that's going to go there. Yeah. And then... Uh, I'm not sure. Are these going to be on opposite sides already? They will. Cool. Okay, so then this belt will run to my mall. So obviously it's going to go down, isn't it? I think they'll be able to put it there. We can offset it. Okay, they're, they're all inserting. Okay, cool. And yeah, I'll run it just like... So, get rid of that light. Don't need no stinking lights. All right, and everything is everything's finished, huh? Crazy. Let's see. Let's see. I just want to clean this up. Is I feel like cleaning stuff up uh now is more desirable than cleaning stuff up at like the beginning of the next episode. You know what I mean? Isn't that so much better? That's so much better. Did I can't insert stuff because my inventory's full, but I fixed that. <laughs> I fixed it. I fixed it. I swear I fixed it. Alright. Oh, I have so much garbage. It's just incredible. It truly is awful. Like iron ore, huh? Uh, where is the crushing of the iron? All right. Okay, guys. Uh, burp, 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 burp. Let me come back here. Make sure I finished cleaning this mess up. Everything's connected. Let me know if something's not connected. Oh, and then I don't need a full chest of this, surely. Just a little buffer should be plenty. Right? Because the miners don't actually use that much. Hold on, I can make them now so I can check. Uh, each medium miner is going to need 
two aluminum carbide. So when I plop down 200 medium miners at once, I'm gonna want 400 aluminum carbide. So we can do that. And that way, um, you know, if I put down a whole bunch of miners without consuming any aluminum, uh, we'll have plenty of that going. All right, well then this looks good. All right, this looks pretty good. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Don't need quite so much plastic, do we? And this is stopped because our chlorine, let's just check our chlorine real quick. Uh, it's still crafting, isn't it? Still crafting. And once it's finished. Yeah, okay, this was good. This buffer situation um, helped me survive <laughs> that oversight. Cool. So that was, yeah, that was huge. And it took forever for these to fill up the belt. I might want more of these maybe. So they'll chew through the chlorine a little faster and that way I'll, hmm. I'm not sure. Oh, well, anyways, uh, we're ready for, for better miners. We're ready for better miners. That's the important thing. Whew. And that's going to be fun. Our mall's getting bigger. Excellent. Let me put lights over there. Let's put lights everywhere. Let there be light. I don't even have lights by my lights. That's tragic. That's just awful. I, I don't notice because it's not dark for me like it is dark for YouTube. You know, I, I know the YouTube algorithm makes it, or not the algorithm. Why am I called the algorithm? The YouTube um, compression and stuff makes things super dark. Um, and I just forget that. I get in the zone when I play Factorio, don't I? And I totally ignore the wants and the needs of the viewer. All right, but that looks pretty good. The mall's getting bigger. I love it. Hope you're having fun. I'll see you guys next time.